So let's solve this problem. So to find vertex, focus, equation of directrix, and the endpoints of the latus rectum of the parabola. So these are the different formulas to find focus, equation of directrix, and the endpoints of the latus rectum. But first, we need to transform this equation to a standard form and to rewrite this equation to a standard form so variable with exponent 2 on the left side since x is the variable with exponent 2 so therefore all x on the left side then the rest transpose to the right side so this positive 5y becomes negative 5y negative 16 becomes positive 16 then we can do now completing the square for x so just take this number ignore the sign so we have 4 then divide this number by 2 take the square so 4 divided by 2 is 2 and 2 squared so this is equal to 4 then we need to add this number to this equation so we have x squared minus 4x then plus 4 and also on the right side so negative 5y plus 16 then also plus 4 then this time we can do no quadratic factoring for x squared so the factors for x squared this is x times x then since the middle term is negative so this is minus and the factors for 4 that's 2 times 2 then quantity to the power 2 then on the right side so bring down negative 5y then we can combine this 16 plus 4 that's positive 20 then this time observe that on the right side there is numerical coefficient for this variable y so we need to put that number outside so this becomes negative 5 so put negative 5 outside so the remaining is y because we put negative 5 outside then for this positive 20 we need to divide this number by this number we put outside so divide by negative 5 so positive 20 divided by negative 5 so this is negative 4 so this is now the standard equation for this parabola then from the standard equation we need to find the three values the h the k and the p so for h just look for x since this is x so therefore this is h and the opposite sign so since this is negative 2 so therefore h is positive 2 then for k just look for y since this is y so therefore this is k then the opposite sign since negative 4 so therefore k is positive 4 and to solve for p so just take this number outside ignore the sign so we have 5 then we need to divide this one by 4 from the formula that's 4p so always divide by 4 to solve for p so p is equal to 5 over 4 and take note that p is always positive that's why we ignore the sign so we have now the three values the h the k 
and the P. Now this time, from the standard equation, observe that this is x squared and negative. So therefore, the standard equation formula is this x squared equals negative 4p. So we can find now focus using this formula, equation of directrix, this formula, and the endpoints of the latus rectum, this formula. So to solve now for the vertex and vertex in the parabola, that's h and k. So vertex equals h is positive 2 and k is positive 4. Then for focus, so for focus, this formula, because this is our standard equation, so we have h, then k minus p, then substitute now the values, so h is positive 2, then k is positive 4, then minus p is 5 over 4, then to simplify, so we can use butterfly method, this is over 1. So 4 times 4, this is 16. And 1 times 5, so we have minus 5. Then 1 times 4, that's 4. Then to simplify, so this 16 minus 5, this one is 11 over 4. So this is now the coordinate for the focus. Then to find now the equation of directrix using this formula. So y equals k plus p, then substitute now the values. So k is 4, then plus p is 5 over 4, then again using the butterfly method, this is over 1, so 4 times 4, that's 16, then plus 1 times 5, that's 5, then over 4, so we have now y equals 16 plus 5, that's 21 over 4. So this is now the equation of the directrix. Then for the last one, the endpoints of the latus rectum. So from this formula, then substitute now all the values. So h is positive 2, then plus minus 2 times p, p is 5 over 4. Then we have k is 4 minus p, that's 5 over 4. Then to simplify, so multiply this 2 and 5. So 2 times 5, this is 10 over 4. Then apply butterfly method, so over 1. So this is 16. Then minus 5 over 4, then this time, we can separate now this plus and minus, so we have 2, then plus, this 10 over 4, reduce, divisible by 2, so this is 5 over 2, then 16 minus 5, that's 11 over 4, then the other one, 2 minus, so this is plus and minus, so plus and minus, then 5 over 2 and 11 over 4. Then to simplify, so using butterfly method, this is over 1, 2 times 2, that's 4, then plus, 1 times 5, that's 5, then over 2, then we have 11 over 4, then the other one, 
So this is over 1, 2 times 2, that's 4, then minus 1 times 5, that's 5, then over 2, then we have 11 over 4, then simplify. So this 4 plus 5, that's 9 over 2, then 11 over 4, then the other one is 4 minus 5, that's negative 1 over 2, then 11 over 4. So these are the coordinates for the endpoints of the lattice rectum.